Last month, Valley View News got the chance to interview Alex and Daisy De La Rosa, independent contractors who filled potholes in Compton on their spare time. Now, they have received a cease and desist from the city. Valley View News' Matthew Bragula tells us what that means for the De La Rosas and how they plan to proceed. We first met them a few weeks ago. After they took it upon themselves to fix potholes that they say plagued Compton streets. We received a letter in the mail uh, soon after we actually got to meet you. A letter from the city telling them to stop the unauthorized repairs and that there could be legal consequences, including fines, penalties, and potential liability for damages. A statement from the Compton City Manager's Office say they've tried to reach out to the De La Rosas, but received no answer. Alex and Daisy say they were never called, even when their phone number was on their public social media. Companies and, you know, sponsors that we've been having, and, you know, they've gotten my cell phone number directly. And they were able to find our address, but apparently they weren't able to find our phone numbers. The couple also decided to show me some of the most damaged roads in Compton, like Santa Fe Street and Acacia Avenue, where potholes range from small to enormous, and vehicles have to drive under five miles an hour to avoid tire or suspension damage. I've also returned to North Largo Avenue, where as you can see, part of the big pothole has been filled, which Daisy says was done by the city. However, there are still pieces of broken road that act as hazards for drivers. But even after going through another pair of tires and a cease and desist, the De La Rosas say they aren't quitting their mission. We've continued filling in potholes on the down low. You know, we sometimes just post pictures. But thanks to all the donations that we have received, we have not stopped. The De La Rosa say until Compton fixes the streets, they will keep using donations to fill the hazards themselves. Reporting from Compton, California, I'm Matthew Bugula for Valley View News.